1111. We can send you a link with all of our coverage. That is where you're going to find this interactive map from Johns Hopkins. It shows all of the confirmed cases. If you zoom in to Texas, yeah, none in Houston. You can see San Antonio is highlighted, but none in Houston. You can also zoom out, get a wider view, and a very clear illustration of where the bulk of those 90 thousand confirmed cases are. So here's the most important thing that I want to stress. Again, no confirmed cases of coronavirus in Harris County. At a press conference yesterday, Judge Lena Hidalgo says you should avoid travel to countries with a high risk. You need to wash your hands, cover your cough. She also added masks don't protect against the virus. If a case were confirmed, Judge Hidalgo says she would notify the community immediately. Now, a lot of people seem to be concerned about the rodeo, but Harris County leaders say, if you're feeling sick with anything, stay home. We want to make sure that if you are sick with symptoms of a respiratory nature, that you are staying home and isolating yourself so you protect yourself, your loved ones, but also the community at large. Now, a couple other headlines you're probably going to see this morning, San Antonio, excuse me, San Antonio is suing the CDC, asking for increased standards when it releases people quarantined for coronavirus. And in Washington, where there are now six deaths linked to the virus, health experts think it was undetected for a week. Again, we have much more information and resources on khv.com slash coronavirus, or just text the link at the corner of your screen. The coronavirus outbreak could put a popular Texas festival in jeopardy Plus a side relief for your 401ks, and the Leaning Tower of Dallas comes crumbling down. Your rough block continues with the day's other big stories. It's a huge money maker for Texas, but thousands of people want South by Southwest organizers to cancel the festival in Austin. A petition calls the event irresponsible amid an outbreak. South by Southwest draws hundreds of thousands of people from around the world. It's set to start March 13th. Organizers say it will go on as planned. 